Hello, this is Chris Kettenbach with Falcon Technologies and today we're going to field terminate the Luxi Electronics HDMI do-it-yourself field termination. Basically what this allows you to do is actually to run your HDMI cable through the conduit and then put your ends on. The HDMI connector itself, you get two pieces for the clamshell. Here's the connector itself, the bottom wire holder, the top wire holder, and this is actually the shield. The tool you need to use does three functions. This one actually ter terminates it. This one prepares the cable for termination. And this one uh, completes the actual uh, uh, shield bonding to the wire. Uh, additional tools you're going to need, a pair of scissors, a razor blade, and sometimes some flush cuts actually help too. The first thing you want to do is actually cut about an inch and a half of, of, of the jacket back with the razor blade. Okay. Now you got your braided shield. You just need to want to bring that straight back all the way back just like this there's an overall foil shield that you actually want to peel back and cut off Now you're going to unwind your actual ribbon cables. And notice you'll have two ribbon cables. You have one larger one, one smaller one. The cotton core, you actually just want to chop that off as well. I'll take a nice pair of sharp scissors and I should cut this at an angle. Okay, now you need to remove this actual shield, outer shield on each ribbon cable. It's actually got adhesive and it's, uh, sometimes it's a little tricky to get this off, so bear with me and uh, we'll see if we can do this pretty quick. Okay, go ahead and cut this one off. Okay, on a larger ribbon cable, you need to actually cut the the, the, the last uh, conductor on this. You need to actually trim that off with the razor blade. Not all the way off. You get to, 
separate it from the actual ribbon and that's the opposite of the actual striped uh, conductor Now you need to actually strip this off. And you fold that back to the actual shield back here, back to the braid. Okay. Alright, now you're going to take your wire holders. There's an actually a little arrow in here that goes on the striped side of the actual ribbon cable. The arrow points in the direction that you insert the cable. I'm sure you can't see it, but there's actually a little arrow right there. So it's on the left, and the black stripe on the on the cable is on the left. that down pretty much as far as it'll go like so do that with the other side So now you need to perform the pre-termination. And that's number one on the tool here. Right here. And the connector orientation needs to be correct. You see it actually says shows you right here what the orientation of the actual connector should be in. Okay, I need to go this way. And push it all the way in. And you see on the back side, it actually cuts that ribbon off. Do the same with the other one. Now you're actually ready to actually terminate the cable. This is actually keyed, so uh, if you look at the holes, you'll see which way it's supposed to be. But one ribbon cable goes on top, one goes on the bottom. Now you're going to use number two on the actual tool here. And it actually shows you the orientation, just like before. Push it all the way in. Do a little squeeze. Okay. The connector is actually on the cable now. Now we just need to put the shield on. So now what you're going to do is take the shield and slide it all in there. Take the other shield and actually put it on top. Do a little squeeze. Make sure that you are actually connected on the sides. Okay. Now what you want to do here, 
to actually get this the, the crimp on the shield just kind of take it and be careful and kind of roll those in just a little bit the fingers right here now you're going to take number three which is down here and in the correct orientation see that actually crimped that down for the actual shield now you gotta trim off all this extra shielding here sometimes the flush cutters work a little better Now you got your shield trimmed back. Now all you have to do is just put on the clamshell. Just snaps together. Peel off that. And there you have it. Thank you for watching.